evening, Sheila. Good evening. And congratulations on being awarded the Black Legends Award, both um, and annual. <laughs> Thank you. So um, I noticed when I was reading your bio, you weren't originally from Silicon Valley. You moved here from um, Los Angeles. Yes, yes. Oh. I'm a native Los Angeles, but I'm a native Californian, California, which is which hard is, to find. It's hard to find. Yes. We are a rare bird. Yes. Absolutely. So what brought you to um, Silicon Valley? Uh, this was a corporate move. Uh, so, yes, following my husband and yep. then getting involved in the community here and uh, getting a position uh, with uh, NASA Ames Research Center. Mm -hmm. So I've been here 37 years now. Wow. Yeah, so this, this is, you might as well say I'm a native. Say you probably spent more time here than Los Angeles. And I did, actually. Right. See, exactly. Yeah. You were born there, but you yes. segued here. Exactly. So yeah, I'm very interested in STEM. Um, I work in Silicon Valley mm -hmm. and, um, you know, for me, not seeing enough um, females getting hired in my engineering roles, etc. burns me. Mm -hmm. So, where did your passion come from to start the STEM program? Well, exactly, it came from the same place you said. There's not enough females in the trades, there's not enough females in the community mm -hmm. that knew that they had the po possibility right. of being an engineer or a scientist. And right. so, uh, with my options and my opportunities at NASA, mm -hmm. I was able to create a program that allows young ladies to get an experience of being on a college campus, of being in a technological field that, that maybe they didn't think about before, but now they realize, well, it's not that bad. I think I could do right. that. <laughs> you know, so yes. that's how we started. Yes, yes. And how are the companies embracing that here in the Valley today, um, the high-tech companies? I think, the they, they, I think they understand there is a need, mm -hmm. but the problem is they don't have the uh, connection to grow the new generation of, of uh, engineers and scientists. Right. And so my group, we start fourth through eighth grade. So we're trying to train them to keep that as a focus yes. so that that can be a college profession for them. That's right. And I think we're also trying to let the young ladies that are in college right now, if they're in those it feels mm -hmm. if there's an opportunity for them to get a job in the local community and not ship off back to some other state. Yes. We want to keep them here in Silicon Valley and grow uh, the women's movement mm -hmm. into the total Silicon right. Valley process. Yes, yes. It's, you, you are correct. Um, unfortunately, I don't get enough of them on a daily basis that I'd like to bring in. So when I find someone is working with STEM, I get very excited. I make sure yeah. everyone in HR knows. I yeah. have someone at a very prominent company now mm -hmm. last week. He reached out to me and just mm -hmm. asked me a couple of questions and it was around how can he engage younger girls into um, the company. Yes. So I'm working with him with some diversity as well because I told yes. him that's part of what we need to see, a nice mixture, you know, let's share with everyone. So, good. We've got to get them, we've got to get them in the, in a program that when they graduate from college, there are job leads right. lined up for them. Exactly. Because if we don't, then yes. what happens in six months, they go home. They go home. Yes. And so, Despite we've worked them. hard to get them developed. Yes. But now, Mm -hmm. uh, there are no jobs, there's no one offering them anything, right. they're being overlooked, and they get to, they go home. And yes, that's, that's not going to change the right. demographics here unless we, once we get them from fourth to eighth grade, mm -hmm. now they're training, they've had the experience of what it's right. like to be on a campus, mm -hmm. now they're training and getting the college classes and courses that's going mm -hmm. to make them certified. Exactly, exactly. And then the final phase, of course, is yes. job like. development. Yes, exactly, mm -hmm. good. Well, I want to thank you again and congratulate you on your award that you'll be receiving this evening. Thank you so much, yes. Matt. Thank you. I've heard a lot about you. All right. <laughs>